On a race day, the main priority is for all the horses that arrive to go home safely, having had a competitive day's racing. First thing in the morning, we'll walk the track and just making sure there's no real change overnight, make sure that it's still completely safe for horse and rider. At the start of the season, we'd have a BHA course inspector come out. They basically go around with us, checking heights, checking fences and hurdles, making sure they're safe for both horse and jockey to jump. Average weekday meeting, we'll have a team of three or four equine welfare and integrity officers of the BHA who look out for the welfare of the horses, keep eyes open, and ensure that all the rules are adhered to and that the integrity of the sport is kept up. When the horses start to arrive, we scan them as they come through the gate. And while we're scanning them, we observe them to make sure that they haven't sustained an injury at travelling to the races, that they haven't lost a shoe or displaced a plate, that their skin is healthy and they generally look happy, healthy horses. After the race, the stewards radio down to the yard to tell us in the sample unit what horse we will be testing. The horse arrives at the sample unit where it's scanned by myself. The horse is then given a warm shower and a drink and it's then walked round until it's cooled off completely and its heart rate's reduced enough for me to take a sample from it. I've been doing this for 20 years. It's my love of horses that brings me into racing and keeps me in the industry. I've been stewarding now for going on 25, 26 years and I think the key reason why somebody gets into a role of stewarding is the love of the sport, the love of the competitiveness of the sport, as well as the equine side of things, the animals. We have to speak for the animals as well and to ensure that everything that we do in the race course is going right by the animals and that's why I'm doing it. The key role for us on the race day is to ensure that all participants in the race are safe, that the rules are followed, the guidances are there to ensure that all participants come back after a race safe sound that we get them all back to their stables and their homes safely. The welfare of the horses on race day is attended to by two groups of vets. You've got the regulatory vets who are responsible for overall welfare of the horses and the integrity of the sport. But then you have the race course vets who are vets who work in practice, attend to any injuries the horses might sustain and administer first aid and treatment. The difference between an ordinary trailer and what these can do is nearly chalk and cheese. These ambulances, they're specifically designed to give a horse the most comfortable journey possible to its stabling. Race day examinations of horses is a constant evolving process, always striving to do better to protect the welfare of the horses that have come to our race courses. Pre-race checks are to make sure that the horse's heartbeat is regular, that they have no obvious signs of injury that might mean they're more likely to suffer injury or accident when they're racing. So we'll fill their legs, trot them up and make sure that their gait is symmetrical. Just before the race starts, I'll come to the parade ring, monitoring the horses and performing further checks to make sure they all look fine. Before we start the race, we get down here on time, we'll have checked the equipment. There's 22 starters in the country altogether, and we've all got a background in horse racing. We've all worked in horse racing all our life. We count the runners down and watch them canter and see how they're moving. We have a good relationship with the jockeys. We see them 200 days a year. If they have any concerns, they'll usually come to us straight away. And we in turn then will speak to the veterinary surgeon who's already at the start watching the horses coming down with us. If a jockey's concerned about the way the horse is moving, we'll take it out from the others, give it a trot up and down, and the veterinary surgeon will have a look at it. If we are concerned with anything, we'll withdraw the horse. We want everything to be fair and well for the horse. All vets on race day are specially qualified equine vets that have to undergo special training and refresh that training regularly. At least one vet will follow them in the convoy during the entirety of the race. Racing is constantly looking to improve how we deliver welfare for the horses. We're always looking back at our statistics of how we're doing and we provide information for each race course as they improve their turf management and the obstacle design and safety. We also look at education right across the spectrum of racing and also from time to time we have to adjust the rules so that the safety of the horses is paramount. Innovation is always coming along, new ideas, new knowledge 
knowledge and these are constantly being used to upgrade how we deliver the racing in the most safe capacity, safe way for horses.